Hello everyone, this is Ian Lamont, publisher of In 30 Minutes Guides, including Microsoft Word in 30 Minutes. Today I'm going to be talking about how to add a comment to a Microsoft Word document. And the reason why you usually add a comment is if you're working on something, uh, collaborating with them, or maybe you have an editor, or maybe your boss, or whatever, you need to add some comment explaining something in your document. And this is how you do it. Open the document, and in this particular document you can see there already are some comments. Uh, this is my collaborator, Zach, and you can see that I've responded to him. And the way to create a comment is basically to open the document, go to the Review tab, and you'll see a whole bunch of options up here. If you want to add a comment, like let's say that I wanted Zach to take another look at this paragraph right here. So I might you just highlight a bit of text, or you can highlight the whole paragraph. And then I can say, just click the New Comment button. There's also a keyboard shortcut. And Zach, could you take another look? Oops. Another look at this graph. Okay. And so then click off that. And you'll see that the comment is is there. It's also color coded. So Microsoft Word, if there's more than one person opening a document, it'll put different colors on this. It doesn't matter if the document is saved on your local hard drive or if it's on OneDrive and you're collaborating with somebody and you're just using the same document. It will still do the color coding business. That's basically how to create a comment. If you go to your document and you don't see any comments and you know that they're there, basically the way to show them is go to the review tab. There's a little drop down uh, right in the middle. and there's a couple options. Original, no markup, all markup, and simple markup. If you want to see the comments and all the other stuff, make sure all markup is selected, and then it will appear. If you have no markup, it will be hidden, which is easier to read. But all markup will show the tracking as well as comments. And by the way, these won't show up in the printed document unless you want them to appear there. And basically, the easy way to hide all that stuff is just to go to the drop down, no markup, and then print out the document. So for more information on how to create comments and how to manage them and how to use other features of Microsoft Word, check out our book, Microsoft Word in 30 Minutes, available from in30minutes.com. Thank you so much.